Let us continue with our lesson and the next step what we will do is we will try to change the color of this particular icon as well as the text. So currently if you see over here on the attributes over here which we have a item text color and here we have a different color selected. So based on the selection you can see that we have a light pink as well as a light uh, brown I think, right? So that is set it over here. So whenever item is selected, we have a light green as well as when item is the text is not selected, then we have some dark brown over here. So what we will do is for that we'll go to the rest folder and we'll go to the values and in color we will add uh, some color over here. So let us uh, select this one and uh, let me add sorry let me add below over here and let me add a two color so one will be of a uh, let me say it as a bottom nav uh, s e l c selected text so when we have a selected text and then we will change the color so let's change the color to uh, give it as a white color so we will say as a two three four five six hex color of, and we'll get a white color over here and then for the another one which is for unselected just copy this one and whenever the bottom nav unselected we will say un unselected then we will have a different color so whenever we have unselected we'll have or something or maybe we can change to something different color subtract so from here or here uh, we have some different color right and for the selected we will have a white color so we have to make use of this color and let's go to the drawable and in the drawable folder we will create a new drawable resource file over here and here we select the selector the root element is selected and the file name let us give a file name I will say tab or we can say uh, B O T T bottom nav text so it's C O L O R color so bottom nav text color so just click on OK so now we have a selector and inside this we can create our item so item that the we have a Android color so let me find the never my N D R Y the android color c o l o r color and uh, which is of equals to and here we have to keep the color so at color we have a uh, nav selected text and uh, we can see this one is for when android state which is of checked so whenever I state is checked then we will have that color so if we say as a true let me arrange it okay and let me close this one and we have another one which is of item android of the color and this color we will have offer at color and we have a C O L O R color slash the bottom unselected so whenever this is for unselected and this is for selected so we have created two items added a two item for this selector one is whenever selected this color is selected white color which is whenever state is checked and uh, we have added that one so let's go back to the main activity and select your bottom nav and from here on the item text color we can select that particular uh, item just select uh, let me select uh, this column and uh, let me go to this split over here and uh, just now we added that color somewhere okay so where is that one this is over here so we have added the the item text color at the color so what I will do is I'll change this one to add drivel D R D R A W A B L E drivel 
less and uh, we have uh, that one which is of the uh, the name of that one is if you go over there if you drivable and where is that one bottom nav bottom nav text color right so we can add that one so b o t t o m bottom underscore nav text so bottom nav text color and if you go to the design now we have changed that one and if you try to run now so let me, let me try to run the application and let us test whether it was success or failure now you can see that when we run the application and you can see that we have a color different so when we select it we have switched it to a white color and uh, whenever there is something it's a dark color so we cannot see that one so let us change that one so that color is too dark so let me change to something a little lighter a little lighter somewhere here i think okay i think that should be fine and go to the activity main yeah let's look uh i think it's more white so let me put a little bit darker somewhere here and okay that said that should be fine so you can run the application and uh, we will check it again so i think that should be much better so you can see that we have a white color when it is selected and when it is not selected we have some uh, little uh, which is lighter color than the of the white color so that's look better that depending on your requirement if you want a more darker color you can uh, just give it a more darker color and uh, yeah that should be all and uh, we have uh, one more option which is to set for the the item icon tint color so if you check we have an item tint color and uh, we can change that one too so whenever we item is selected we will switch to different color and it is not selected then we can switch it to a different color so let's do it in the next lecture till then have a great day